What's up guys, Lil Mike here and today I bring you a FIFA 14 Ultimate Team um, um, Squad Builder. It's a pretty cheap team, it shouldn't cost you more than 15k. It's a non-rare Bundesliga side and it's I'm using the 4-1-2-1-2 formation. So it will be a pretty good team to start out with. So let's go through the players. Up front we've got Yakonen. Ivory Coaston from um, he's playing for Hanover and he's got 83 pace, 80 dribbling, 76 shooting, as well as 71 hitting. So he's got pretty good all round stats for a striker, and he's a pretty good option to start your team out with if you're on a tight budget. And next to him is his teammate Dioff. Dioff, um, he's got 88 pace, as well as 70 shooting, and 84 hitting. So he's a pretty um, strong player and um, I hear that um, heading is very overpowered in FIFA 14, so he would be a pretty good player with that 84 heading, and he'll be quite a beast to use, especially he's also got 88 pace. I think he's got three-star skills, so the two strikers have got three-star skills, I believe. And then in at center attacking mid, we have the young and up-and-coming superstar Draxler from Germany, plays for Skolka. He's got 78 pace, 78 shooting. 79 passing and 85 dribbling, so very good all-round stats for non-rare gold. And also he has 4-star skills and 5-star weak foot, so that's extremely good um, for a non-rare Bundesliga um, player that costs very cheap. He wouldn't cost more than uh, 1k, I would say. And in at left mid is a Traore. He's got 87 pace, 83 dribbling. And he's got four-star skills, I believe, but he only has two-star weak foot, and he is left-footed. Let's just quickly look. Yeah, left-footed, and so he'll be good for the crossing into your strikers, but cutting in on his right foot would be a bit of a weakness, but he's a pretty good pacey left mid to use, and he's pretty cheap as well. So in at right mid, we have the Portuguese international, Verinha. He has 83 pace, 72 shooting, 72 passing, and 84 dribbling. So good all-round stats for him as well. And he's got four-star skills and is very cheap as well. In at center defensive mid, we've got a very pacey center defensive mid from America. And he plays for FC Skolka. He's got 81 pace there, and he's got very good defensive stats as well. With 79 defending and 72 heading. He's also got pretty decent passing with 72 Passing and he's got a hard defensive work rate, which is what you need in the center defensive mid position. And he's pretty cheap, cost about 1k as well. Then in at left back, we've got a German player, Janssen. He's got 80 pace, uh, 76 defending, and 71 heading. So that's pretty good stats as well. There's a few other options you can go with at left back, like such as Schmelzer from Borussia Dortmund. But I went with Janssen instead because he's slightly cheaper. And, um, yeah, in at right back, we've got Jung. I think that's how you say it. Um, he's okay. He's got okay stats. Not the best in the world. He's not going to set anything a lot. But he's got 78 pace, 74 defending, and 67 heading. So I thought he was one of the better cheap non-rare players you can go with. In at centre back, we've got Diagne. And he's got quite amazing stats for 76 rated centre back. 74 pace. 76 defending and 80 heading. So he's got very good heading to um, defend those crosses and corners, which is what you need in this year's FIFA. Then the other centre back, we've got Jijiru. Is that how you say it? Correct me if I'm wrong. He formerly played for Arsenal, but now he is in the Bundesliga and he's got 72 pace, 76 defending, and 77 heading. There's a few other centre back options you can go with. But in my opinion, these are the two best. Let's check their heights. Uh, 191 centimeters. That is flippin' tall, as well as 185, which is not that tall, but it's pretty tall. And then moving on to our keeper, we've got Vise or Vise, should I say? Um, 81 def uh, diving. I was going to say defending. 81 diving and 85 reflexes being his standout stats and as well he's 193 centimeters tall which is extremely tall um, for a goalkeeper well goalkeepers are usually pretty tall but he is one of the taller ones out there and he's got pretty decent stats for non-rare gold and he's extremely cheap only goes for like 400 500 coins 
So that's the team. So this will be a very good um, fitness team to use or cheap starter team to use if you're on a tight budget, which most of you would be at the beginning of FIFA. So anyway, that's going to be the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe and see you guys later.